Good evening, family. I am your host, Infinite Child. And before the night ends, I have to give us this word. Amen. Hope you guys could hear me. Um, welcome, subscribers, and those who are just who uh, are led to tune in. Today, uh, we are doing uh, the fellowship, um, fellowship social mixer. Okay, so feel free to uh, tune in on the uh, on the rerun. Um, but for those that are uh, with, with this channel, you know, uh, we, we are in this marathon together, okay? You know, I hear the word, hear, hear what the Lord is speaking to us. And, you know, and always test the spirits, okay? And um, seek the Lord, seek the Lord. And he is speaking to his children. Because mind you, he said, you know, in the last days, I he's doing, a, a, you know, pouring out his spirit on all, you know, sons and his daughters, you know. Uh, pouring out his spirit and it, it you know you can find that in x and you know god he's 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 always working right he never sleeps he 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 never slumbers you know our father is always working and so um tonight uh we're going to uh speak about the awakening i'm fixed it's fixed in my mind to uh to to title this for those who you know are into uh the topic or 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 titles um uh, the, the awakening the the awakening glory be to god the awakening so family how many people know that our wisdom and uh knowledge comes from the holy spirit the holy spirit that you know works in and through us the awakening right some things you know the the you know uh in in our lives you know situations circumstances that we have uh, encountered once before and even now you know the lord shake shake, shake shake some things up right uh you know um a lot has happened you know and and i will tell you this you know the lord he's not in it he's not always in it and, you know and sometimes we could mistake you know the father uh, allowing things to to you know come to pass in our lives and you know family there are things that we can prevent okay we can prevent the awakening okay the awakening the transition and in your hearts your mind and understand the awakening in your hearts your mind your minds uh, this we, we're going to speak plural the the awakening the transitioning in your hearts our hearts our minds our understanding and understanding wisdom and knowledge of god the wisdom and knowledge the father is in the son the son is in the father okay and the holy spirit comes he is our comforter glory be to god jesus christ ascended back and he sits on the right hand side of the father and so now we have the comforter and the comforter lives in and through us which is the holy ghost the holy spirit right and the holy spirit what he hears from the father that's what he speaks and so everyone every one of us whether you believe it or not every one of us can hear the father speak and, and the father says, my children know my voice. Okay. So the transition in our hearts, our minds and understanding. Okay. So let's put some word on it. Okay. We're going to put some word on it and bear with me, family. Bear with me. And so when we uh, when we have this this uh, uh, this total this total uh, uh, awakening in in our lives, and our spiritual eyes are open, the veil is lifted, uh, you know, and 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 you know, and we see through the lens, through through the eyes of our Father, and how wretched and 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 just dong that we were, you know, 
excuse me, how how just pitiful, you know, how 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 pitiful and just dong, disgusting. Uh, I mean, I think I can say, you know, uh, just wretched, wretched. I mean, that's that's a strong word itself, wretched. Wretched, we we were, right? Um, let's give the definition. You know, our, our wretchedness that we used to be in. You know, we, you know, uh, you know, miserable, uh, deep affliction or distress from anxiety, grief, uh, want, right? So much, so much, uh, you know, calamity that happened in, you know, calamity, you know, uh, worthless, uh, uh, you know, how, how vile and contemptible, despicable we were, we was, okay, we was, all right, and being that we had this, the awake, because sin, the, the you know, the, the wage of sin is death, okay, and that's where, once upon a time, that's where, you know, uh, we was in, in, in you know, in, in, in our lifetime, you know. But because, glory be to God, because of the awakening, family, because of the awakening, you know, our hearts, our mind, our understanding, we understand, we, we, we receive the word of God. God has, you know, cleansed us with his word, right? And so we, we live different. We have a different perspective, right? A different perspective. And so I want you guys to follow me. Um, you know, again, I, as I said before, you know, the, the, the clarity, clarity in Christ, you know, in, in, in the word of God and what he says about each and every one of us. Okay, and so the, the, the awakening, the awakening, okay, um, we're going to, um, let's, let's, uh, again, let's put some, some word on it. And so now that we have the awakening, right, it, we, we are able, glory be to God, we are able to live in the supernatural rest of God, the supernatural rest of God, okay. excuse me family forgive me oh excuse me and so the awakening okay so let's uh let's 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 uh read um yes excuse me psalms let's go to psalms chapter 67 psalms chapter 67 family and feel free to seek the word yourselves. And we're gonna uh we're gonna um read scripture from I am uh, pressed to uh you know read from uh Galatians and, and, and Ephesians. But let's go to Psalms family. Chapter 67. 67. All right. All right. And so the awakening, because again, you follow me, family, because of the awakening, you know, God is merciful to us. And he has always been, He's, he has always been, and, you know, long suffering and, and just, you know, waiting, waiting for our yes, right? And, and, and faith comes by hearing and hearing the word of God, amen? And so receiving the word, the, the ingesting the word right and let let the word manifest in our lives right letting the word uh uh shine you know like you know how they uh, how they say you know the intake the food that you intake right like okay 
Thank you, Holy Spirit. For example, David, right? You know, the king, uh, the, you know, wanted him and, and, and the others, the, the he, Hebrew boys to eat, you know, his feast, what, what he was serving, right? But Daniel said, no, I only eat this, you know, and, 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 and after um, so many days, you know, Daniel came out looking better, <laughs> better than the, 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 the rest of the people, right? Because what he ingested. And so, like the word of God, it manifests what we ingest, what we intake, it manifests on the outside. It manifests on the outside, right? And it could it, it could be seen, right? There's a difference, right? It, it shows itself. It shows itself, right? And 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 God bless us. And, and He causes His face to shine upon us, right? And and so the awakening, the awakening, you know, we are able to praise God, right? We we see His being joyful, and we see, you know, and 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 you know, um, it's all about God. It's all about God. It's all about God. And so in Psalms uh, sixty-seven, we're going to read verse six and seven. Then the earth shall yield her increase. God, our own God, shall bless us. God shall bless us, and all the ends of the earth's earth shall fear Him. Right, and so being that we again, and that we we are in the awakening, right, and we know that uh, you know there is there is no limit to what is happening or going on, and you know what is happening with you because of the Father, He oversees every 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 situation in your life if we allow him right we allow him to shepherd us we allow these things and so being that we are governed and we in in his children finally has the awakening in their lives and the ingest uh of, of his word the earth even the earth shall yield unto us increase and God will con consistently, continuously bless us because we 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 finally know where we stand. We finally, uh, you know, uh, receive the word. We find finally stand in alignment with God. Finally, we allow God to do His work in in and through our lives, right? Because of the awakening, Hallelujah. And family, I want this to make sense to you. Um, um, let's um, let's all um, let's all get the uh, definition. Okay. Um, so the awakening, you know, the revival, the vitality in our lives, right? You know, uh, the the revival of God's word. Uh, you know, our uh, you know, our attention, attention. You know, our attention to God's word, our our attention on God, Amen. And so, being that we all, you know, are in the awakening, uh, have had an awakening. Glory be to God. Now, family, that awakening. The awakening it 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 presents itself, you know. It presents itself, and and, and when I say presents itself, it's us uh, walking in the spirit, walking in the spirit. No longer, excuse me. No longer condemned. No longer uh, under the curse. Right. We have been redeemed from the curse, the law. Amen. We are not under the law because of the awakening. And for us, as we know, Galatians family, uh, uh, follow me, Galatians chapter 5. Um, we're going to uh, begin in, in verse uh, 22. The fruit of the spirit family. So we walk in the fruit of the spirit, okay, which is love, joy, peace, self-control, long-suffering, kindness, goodness, amen. 
of faithfulness, gentleness. And this is and this is how we live. And and this is how we walk. This is how we conduct ourselves. Amen. And because of the awakening, right, against such there is no law. And because we are in Christ. And we walk in the spirit. Okay. And it's and, and, and it's not. It's not by our power. It's not by our, our works. It's because of Christ. Jesus Christ. And what he has done for us. Alright. Because by grace. We have been saved. Alright. We have been saved. Hallelujah. Through faith. Through faith, your faith, my faith, through faith. Amen. All right. And so, uh, you know, the awakening being that we are, you know, we have by, we have vital, you know, our vital, how, how the vitality that we have, how, how vital it is to, to uh, consume the word, to, to, to ingest the word and to walk in the spirit and to, um, we, we have to pray. We have to worship God in truth and in spirit because God is spirit and we are ourselves spirit family. Okay. We are spirit ourselves. And, it, and, and that's how we give our attention to the father. We give our attention to the father. All right. We, our attention to the father. And, and now that, you know, our understanding is not, uh, is not darkened and, and we're not alienated okay we're not we're, we're not our, our hearts are no longer blind right even though it it was the past sometime okay you know in the in in, in but now we learn of Christ we learn of Christ and we 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 hear him and and being taught by him, right? Being taught by him. And so no longer no longer we are who we used to be. We are awakened, okay? And and you know, our form, formal conduct, we put that off, you know, and and, and 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 you know everything's been renewed. Everything has been renewed in the spirit of our minds, right? The transition of our heart and understanding in and through Christ. Hallelujah. So family, uh, know where you stand. Know where you stand. Know who you are. Your awakening. Your awakening. Is, is the preface. Of receiving everything. That the Father has for you and what he says about you and us. You and I, okay? And so our character is brand new. We put on the new person. We set our 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 and, and let's let's put some word on it. So we're gonna go to Colossians chapter three, okay? Chapter three. We're gonna start in verse two. Set your mind on things above, not on things on the earth. For uh, verse three, for you died and your life is hidden with Christ in God. Verse four, when Christ, who is our life, appears, right? Let's go back to this. Let's go back to what I said earlier with Daniel. Excuse me. He only ate fruits and vegetables. He didn't. He didn't intake what the the king was offering. Right. Daniel was on another plateau. He already knew what he was doing. He already, you know, had it. It was set in his set in his way. Set in his mind. I am not of the world. I am different. I am governed. By God, by heaven, not of the world. The king moves no mountain mountain with me, right? And so 
with him as with him, you know, hidden with Christ hidden and, you know, and the ingest of what he already knew and the, the ingest, the intake of, of the fruits and vegetables, it appeared the, 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 if you, if you will, you know, the vitamins, the, 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 the everything, the, the vitality that was, you know, and the fruits and vegetables, it appeared on the outside. It appeared, right? It manifested itself. And, and how different he was from the from from the rest of the people okay and so with us who is our life in Christ Christ who is our life appears then you also will appear with him in glory okay so for we are hidden in Christ okay and and we set our mind on things above only, right? Because this is a commandment. This is this is the awakening, right? This is you know uh, uh you know the awake. I, I want to I want to say streamline us into, but that's not true. Um, it's 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 a, it's the process. It is the process. Thank you, Holy Spirit. It is a process that we walk. And that it is a process that we live in. Okay. And so. We are renewed in knowledge. We are a new renewed in knowledge. We are awakened. Okay. In knowledge. And according to the image of God. You know. Who, cre who created all things. Right. All things. All things. And again, we put off the old, we put off the old man and the old deeds that we used to, uh, that we used to have. And we put on the new man. When, when it says man, that means, you know, uh, human beings, man or woman who is renewed. Okay. And so we have to, uh, you know, continue again. Like I said before, it is setting your mind and, and knowing who you who you are and your identity in Christ, right? And walking in it. And, you know, it is a continual um, um, awakening, you know, and again, and that's, again, I, I, I would be fair to say that it is a part of the mind, to set your mind when, when God allows us to wake up and see another day with breath in our body, we have to set the pace we have to set the date and set our minds and again it is the awakening of who we are amen of who we are and as we know all things are spiritual you know and carnality is the enemy you know it is the enemy it is the enemy and you know we, we have uh we, we have to learn to speak the language uh, from the Bible, okay? We have to learn to speak the language from the Bible. And we have to uh, declare and decree these things and prophesy these things in our, in the, the word in our lives. Amen. And again, it is a part of the awakening family. The awakening, the authority, the right, the power, the permission. From God for each and every one of us for whosoever 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 and let's go to uh, we're still in Colossians chapter 2 we're going to uh, start at verse 6 and as you therefore have received Christ Jesus the Lord the awakening so walk in him then say walk by yourselves. Walk in him because it is his power, his doing, his strength. We are connected to the vine. And without him, we cannot do anything. Amen. Rooted and built up in him and established in faith. As you have been taught abounding in it with thanksgiving. 
Amen. And let's just continue. And we're going to uh, leave it off at here. At, at here. Uh, we're still going to continue in Colossians. Uh, we're going to uh, continue in, 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 you know, in verse 8. Beware, lest anyone cheat you through philosophy and empty deceit according to the tradition of men, according to the basic principles of the world, and not according to Christ. For in him dwells all the fullness of the Godhead bodily, and you are complete in him, who is the head of all principality and power. And guess what, family? He gave us authority of all principality and power. Be not deceived, family. Okay, so we are in Christ because of the awakening. The awakening, okay? We have the right, the power, the permission, the authority from God. And again, it is the transition, transitions, right? Not, you know, the renewing of our mind, glory be to God, not be, for us not to be conformed to this world, but the renewing of our minds, glory be to God, the transitions in our hearts, minds, and understanding because of Christ, because of the awakening, okay? So family, let this word bless you. I hope this word meets you where you are. And I hope this word resonates with you. Again, uh, this is Fellowship Social Mixer. Wednesdays and Sundays. Okay, and feel free to tune in. Uh, I, I'm not going to do lives. Uh, not, not, at, not, not right now. Okay. Um, not right now. Um, lives will come later. Uh, according, uh, you know, thy will, Lord's will. Uh, feel free to catch it on the rerun. And again, if you have any questions, feel free to email me. Feel free to leave a comment and feel free to uh, subscribe or, you know, and, and share this content. Um, you know, the Lord will exalt this channel in due time. OK, and and those who have ears, let them hear. OK, hear the word of God and and, you know, and continue to be encouraged. Do not be weary and well doing. Continue to increase in your faith and to to continue to walk with God and just knowing that you do have a purpose you do have a there there's you do have a connection with the father and you know and you you are whom he called you to be right and there's power your power your connection your purpose okay for whosoever whosoever that's for anyone amen anyone and so, family, uh, be, continue, be encouraged, be expecting. The Father is doing wonderful things in your life. I'm excited for you. And he is doing wonderful things in my life. And we can only we praise him, praise him, praise him, thank him. And he's well-deserving, well-deserving of it. And not just because of the blessings that we receive, glory be to God. Because of who he is. Amen. Are you seeing God correct, correctly? Are you seeing him correctly? And everything that you see in the Father, everything that you see in the Father, that's what you will receive, okay? And we are not mediocre, okay? We are not average, all right? We are the orca, all right? We are the peculiar. We are the remnant, right? We are the treasure. We are the salt, you know? We are the light. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Amen. So, family, this word will bless you, okay? This word will bless you and receive it by faith. Receive it. Remember, it is the currency and it is impossible to please God without faith. And fret not. Jesus Christ is the author and finisher of your faith, our faith. Come on. It's a gift. <laughs> All right. And so the father is good. Know it. Believe it. The father is good and he is faithful. So be steadfast. Continue to expect. 
expect. And it is, I tell you this family, it is a warfare, a spiritual warfare. And the enemy will try to get you off course. Yet we are strong in the Lord. Hallelujah. We are strong in the Lord. We are strong in the Lord. And whatever uh, the Father wants you to do, he will tell you. He, do, he will reveal it unto you. Okay. And this is a marathon. It is a marathon. Okay. So do not be weary. Continue. Be steadfast. Continue. Stand on his word. Continue to believe. The just shall live by faith. It is a command. We shall, what that is, present. We live by faith. We walk by faith. Doesn't matter what it is. We walk and we live by faith. Amen. We thank you, Father, for your word. Father, we thank you of who you are and whom you called us to be. In Jesus' mighty name, Father. And we thank you for the wonderful works that you have done. Things that you have done that we know not about, Father. And what is to come in Jesus' mighty name. And that we live, we move our being is it is in you, Father, and only you, and we give authority to your word, and we hear your voice, Lord God. We hear your voice, and that our hope and confidence is in you daily, daily, Father, and that we keep our eyes on you, Father, and that we keep our hands on the plow and not turn, and not turn, Father, for we want to be worthy. Of you, we want to be worthy of your calling. And we want to be worthy of who you say that we are in your eyes, Father. And we thank you because of the Holy Spirit, because of the blood of your Son, Father. We are able. We are able to come to you. We are able to come to your throne with boldness. In Jesus' mighty name, and to trust you with all of our hearts, our minds, our strength, and our spirit, Father, and that you will shepherd us in, in any place that we need to go, Father. You will direct our paths. Your light is a lamp. Your word unto our feet, Father, unto our paths. And we thank you, and we are so grateful, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we ask in prayer. Amen. So, family, receive it. God is for you. God is for you. Don't turn your back. And do not give up. In your weakness, he is your strength. Amen. Family, I love you all with the love of Christ. And for those who are not saved, John 3, 16. Repent. Confess. Confess. Believe in your hearts. Confess with your mouths. Amen. Jesus came so that we may have life and have life. What? More abundantly. We don't, we have, we don't have to wait to get to heaven. Amen. And there is no comparison. No comparison. Yet we are able to enjoy the gifts, the blessings here on earth. Amen. And glory be to God, there is no lack. There is no lack. Hallelujah. There is no lack. There is no lack. Amen. So, family, let's continue to walk that narrow path. Let's continue to praise our Father. Let's continue to love on Him and let Him love on us. And we stand steadfast and we keep our faith. We have our faith in Him and Him only. And we give authority to His voice and His word. And we let it work in and through us. And we let the Father show up and show out. Amen. And again, do not let the blessings overtake you. Because remember who it comes from the Father. And as you give it easily, he will take it away. All right. So family, be encouraged. I love you all with the love of Christ. Continue to believe. Expect it. Hallelujah. Expect it. Expect it. Amen. Be safe. Have a good night. Enjoy the rest of your night. I am Infinite Child. And as the word is, so be it unto 
you, so be it unto us, so be it unto me. The Father is good and he is faithful in his will for your life. His plans for your life shall come to pass. Amen. Believe it, receive it, family. Hallelujah. Believe it, receive it. Believe it, receive it. Believe it, receive it. Yes, Lord, we thank you. We thank you, Father. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you, Father. Amen. We thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Family, this is the Lord. Know who he is. See him correctly. See him correctly. See him correctly. Amen. You guys have a good night. Uh, be blessed. Know that you are blessed. Be a blessing unto others. Amen. The blessing is on your head. Amen. We will talk soon. I am Infinite Child. Have a good night. Peace.